there's a very interesting element of the system that maybe we should talk about, and that is the seminal ovarian kung fu. Mm -hmm. Why don't you just try to explain a little bit about that? Yeah, the seminal and ovarian kung fu is a primary is in the Chinese. We are very concerned about the sex energy, which in fact a lot of people when talk about sex, they say oh, maybe dirty or this and that, but nobody can away with the sex. We are born with sex. If no sex, we have no 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 human in the world. So in the Tao system is that if you know how to conserve the energy, if you know how to traverse the sexual energy, if you are not used for uh, reproductions, why have you have to throw it out? In the in the Chinese when we talk about seminal and we talk about ovarian, that means these are two main energy in the body. Uh, I have a rough estimate that said uh, men about the whole life can have about 5,000 ejaculations. So we, we say that's about 5,000 shots. But now a lot of people don't know how to conserve the energy. They think that their bullet is un, uh, unlimited. Unlimited. Lim limited. Unlimited. Just shoot it out, and when they get to a, to a certain age, they get old, they get sick because they drain out the energy. The sexual energy is a very powerful energy, which you can be saved. And a lot of moral running down when the people have excess sex and don't know how to properly perform the sex. In the Chinese, we regard the sex as a very sacred. It's not just a dirty. When you're going to perform it, it's have a lot of rituals. Do it right. Do it right is just better than do it not right. Mm 